Pastels are the first thing I do to interact with life. Uh, I do them, well, I do them for probably uh, maybe half the year, maybe three quarters of the year, and then the rest of the year I, I paint. So a lot of them I go to a diner and I, and I pick something to draw, or I go to uh, various places. I go to Cartman and Bustleton, there's a bus stop there, and that's where I go to Fifth and um, only in, in Broad Street, the bus bus terminal there. Um, so I know there's going to be people there, and I, I, and I can find somebody to draw, to, to do a pastel. Um, sometimes the landscapes. It, it takes a while to get a good one. Um, sometimes I get a good one right away, but a lot of the times, it's I, I, I go there more than one time, and in each drawing is a little bit different. So it's a fine line. Fine line between having them too realistic and having them so abstract, it's hard to do any of them other than just copy them. And I, the paintings aren't, the paintings are recreations, but they're not copies. Um, and in Philadelphia, especially, the there was always this kind of attitude that, um, oh, if he paints longer, he'll get it right. You know, which meant you'll get it more realistic. And then what I was actually doing is trying to move away from that. I want them to be something that will exist on their in their own right, you know, not just as a caveat towards looking at a particular scene. I hope you can join us this Sunday, uh, December 2nd, from 3 to 5, um, afternoon, Sunday afternoon. Um, Enjoy some art and uh, uh, hopefully take home a pastel. Yeah, and I'll, I'll hopefully take a pastel home. Or more than one for that matter. <laughs> or, a, or a painting. <laughs> or a painting. Uh, but uh, there'll be a bunch of stuff to look at, anyhow. And, uh, and hopefully it'll be a fun time. Perfect.